Hey there, it's Dan from Bokane Designs. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to import an oversized database into your database on SiteGround. And typically what happens is um, when you have a database, you can go to PHP My Admin, and this is going to let you upload a file. But SiteGround does have a max upload limit. Uh, you can see it's 128 megabytes, and they don't let you change this. Uh, this might be this will be higher if you're on like the cloud or business hosting, but even on GoGeek they cap it at uh, 128. But if you have a database that's a gigabyte or something, which is common enough, um, you still can add it to your database. And the way you do that is first go to File Manager, and we're going to go ahead and I'm just going to add a small database file here, but the practice, the method is the same. So first upload your database to SiteGround. So in this case, it's just a 22 byte database. It's a blank text file, but this could be a four gig file and this method would still work. Go ahead and put, get your file on the server. See, we've successfully uploaded it and then go to the database you want to import it into. So we're going to add it to the one database we have here. And then you can click the dots here and do import database dump. And it's going to let you select a file from your computer or from your uh, server to import. So you can see I clicked on the button and now I'm going to browse to the file. I put it in the public HTML folder. There's my database. We'll click select. We'll click import. And it failed because this isn't actually a database file. Um, but if there's a real database file, just finish importing, and then you could go to PHP My Admin, and it would.